What's up, YouTube? My name is Vinny Fraser, also known as Vincentius Music, here with my beautiful fiance, Becca, and we are Real, Real Reactions. Reactions. Blah. What's up, YouTube? Thanks for coming to our channel today. Real Reactions here, and today we're getting into some Kendrick Lamar. Euphoria. Just released. One hour ago, 4,000 views so far. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to like the video in the description that we are reacting to. And don't forget, if you change your perception, you can change your reality. You know what's funny about that, actually? What? Funny about what? Released one hour ago with 4.8 thousand views, right? Right. No Life Shack's reaction was posted. Where is it at? One hour ago with 119,000 views. More people so watched more people. his reaction to it than they did watch Kendrick Lamar. Now, that doesn't go for Kendrick Lamar's, like, streaming numbers, right? Like, if he released a song and everybody went straight to Apple and Spotify and shit to listen to it, then he probably got millions of views already. But it just throws me off a little that he has 1,000 views and Whoosh, he has 100,000. Yeah, <clears throat> just a little bit. Well, and it's also released at the same time, you know, so... Yeah. Maybe they just already know it's going to be some shit, so they're like, we need no life shack to break it down for us, please. <laughs> yeah. All right. Kendrick Lamar, man, euphoria, finally. Let's get this shit. Woo, shit, my man, see if you Euphoria. What the fuck did that just say? <laughs> that was a little backwards part. I know someone out there knows what it said. Woo, shit, my man, see if you Euphoria. Come on, Kendrick. This is hip-hop, baby. Them superpowers get neutralized. I can only watch in silence. The famous actor we once knew. Hold up. Sorry, I forgot. The famous actor we once knew. <laughs> um, we, what? we obviously reacted to J. Cole's response to Kendrick Lamar. Um, I think it was blocked for like a week and then we finally got it up. But we also just listened to Drake's Dropping Give Me 50 song so yep. that we are a little bit more caught up. So. He doesn't like Drake very much, so he said, that's not coming to my channel. I, <laughs> I said, don't mind Drake, I just right. I don't want to bring Drake to the channel, sorry guys. But, if you're interested, you can join Patreon at any time, become part of the real family, and you can request anything you want over there since it's a sub subscription-based Based. platform. So, that's one way to get any artist you want to the channel, or to Patreon, just join up and send us a message. I love the, um, I love the beat. This is like some baby making music thing, you know? <laughs> um, and it's just the the word he chose to put on the screen. Yeah. What he's about to talk about. Yeah. I like down here it says they had almost a week to recover from the euphoria of Tuesday's serious winning victory. Yeah. It's Tuesday. It's like he puts a lot of thought into his shit, man. It is Tuesday. All right, let's get it. Woo, she my man, see if you Euphoria. Them superpowers get neutralized, I can only watch in silence The famous actor we once knew is looking paranoid and now spiraling You're moving just like a degenerate, heavy antique is feeling distasteful Why calculate you, not as calculated, I can even predict your angle Fabricating yeah. stories on the family front, cause you heard Mr. Morale A pathetic master manipulator, I can smell the tales on you now You're not a rap artist, you a scam- Hold on, I get it. I can smell the tales on you now Come on Okay, but also I can smell the hold on. No, that's the tales telling telling fake stories. Yeah, I was thinking about because just prior to that he said, "Oh, I can smell the tails." Oh, okay. But like the fins, you know, the tails okay, at the yeah. end, you know, because that is just fishy, you know. Yeah. Uh, but then I was like, wait, are, are they called tails or are they called fins? Or? Yeah. I think I think that's a good one though. I didn't catch yeah. that double. You did say tails, and it made me think of story tales. And just prior to that, he said. He said, you're making up stories after you heard Mr. Morale. Mm -hmm. And so it kind of goes with that. But also, you have multiple tales. Right, because you can tell different tales. Because you're a hell of a serpent. Yeah, yeah. liar. Fucker. We once knew us looking paranoid and now spiraling You're moving just like a degenerate Heavy antique is feeling distasteful Why calculate you're not as calculated I can even predict your angle Fabricating stories on the family front Cause you heard Mr. Morale A pathetic master manipulator I can smell the tales on you now You're not a rap artist, you're a scam artist With the hopes of being accepted Tommy Hilfiger stood out But FUBU never had 
He said, he said, you're what? Ugh, it was so hard. How does it just go right out of my head like that? Um, Modest with a hopes of being accepted. Time he said, you're a scam artist with hopes of being accepted. With no hopes of being accepted? I forget what he said. Right. Blame you now. You're not a rap artist. You're a scam artist with a hopes of being accepted. Time or with a host. With the hopes of being accepted. Okay. Yeah. Blame you now. You're not a rap artist. You're a scam artist with a hopes of being accepted. Tommy Hill figure stood out, but Fubu never had been your collection. I make music that electrify him. You make music that pacify him. I can double down on that line, but spare you this time. That's random acts of kindness. Know you're a master manipulator and a habitual liar too. But don't tell no lie about me, and I won't tell truths about you. Yeah. <laughs> 57 seconds in there, we got beat switch. Don't tell them any lies about me and I won't tell them any truths about you. Uh -huh. Ugh, that's hard. Yeah, man. Ugh. Drake got a lot of secrets, man. There's this country song I heard the other day and this girl's talking about like, telling them why we broke up. Like, my mama taught me never say anything bad about you, but I'll tell you what you didn't do, you know? Or like, all the things you didn't do for me in that relationship. Yeah. Um, I thought it just like correlated that so good. Yeah. It's things. clever. It is very clever. I can double down on that line, but spare you this time. That's random acts of kindness. Know you're a master manipulator and a habitual liar too. But don't tell no lie about me, and I won't tell truths about you. Come on. Shoo! 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 Yeah, I'm out the way, yeah, I'm low, okay, yeah, the island right here is remote, okay, I ain't thinking about no reaper, nigga, I'm reaping what I sow, yeah. okay, got a Benjamin and a Jackson all in my house, like I'm Joe, okay, hell cat, made his own voice in them types of LA solo, okay, everybody wanna be demon, till they get chipped by your throwaway, Ooh. and I might do a show a day, what's a lame, always a lame, oh, you thought the money, the power of fame will make you go away, have you well- I lost it somewhere. What's going in? So in the beginning, he's like describing him going down a, like in my head, I saw like somebody with Royal Combat, like fighting down an alleyway, right? Okay. Like, is that what you're, is that what you envisioned? And then like demons, he said something about the Reaper lurking in the back, right? So like the Death Reaper. He like, said I ain't afraid of the Reaper. I think that's what he said. Shoo! Shoo! I'm out the way, yeah, I'm low, okay, yeah, the island right here is remote, okay, I ain't thinking about no reaper, nigga, I'm reaping what I sow, okay, got a Benjamin and a Jackson all in my house, like I'm Joe, okay, hell cat, made his own voice in them types of LA solo, okay, everybody wanna be demon, till they get chipped by your throwaway, and I might do a show a day, what's a lame, always a lame, oh, you thought the money, the power of fame will make you go away, have you ever played, have you ever, okay, nigga, let's play, have yeah. you ever, watch your enemy down, like with a poker face Have you ever Paid 500,000 Like to an open case Well I have And I failed at both But I came out straight yeah. I hate when I rap Or talk about guns Then somebody mm -hmm. died they Listen Right when he switched The cadence And took away that I forget what you call it man But on this part right here He's like ah, ah, When he's rapping Like in the beginning Of a couple of the words He sounds like he's out of breath And he's like running He's been running forever And he just can't speak right It's actually a technical writing ability to yeah. vocal project that it's like a, a technical thing from way back in the day like the 70s or some shit and uh, I remember watching a documentary on some of his vocal projection techniques that he uses and they're all like from different genres of hip-hop and he like incorporates the exact technique and I, I feel like that was when he switched cadences right there he just got off of that technique for a second it wasn't it was all intentional, you know? I thought it sounded really weird. It was, uh, uh, oh, he's rapping and shit, but then he switched right into rapping. So now I'm gonna go back and listen to it and see what it sounds like thinking about the fact that that's like a technical ability that he purposely put in there. Oh, you thought the money, the power of fame will make you go away? Have you ever played? Have you ever? Okay, nigga, let's play. Have you ever watch your enemy down? Like with a poker face? Have you ever paid 500,000? So he says, okay, let's play. 
And then he goes into that cadence as well as what he's saying. You know, have you ever hunt your enemy down the poker face type shit? But it's so cool though because he's like really fucking into that. Have shit. you ever hunt him down like face to face, like with your poker face on? Like mm-hmm. he doesn't have a fucker. Exactly. You know? Um, instead of like doing it all in the backgrounds, yeah, all this and there. Yeah. Uh, it's cool that you caught on to that because like I can hear it and it's definitely like noticeable. Yeah. But I would have never stopped to talk. It was bothering me. I was like, why the fuck is he just switched to that breathing technique right there? Then I was like, oh shit. Then he switched right back. It was only like eight bars long, but it's fucking right. Like it just goes over some of our heads. Yeah. Yeah. Show a day, what's a lame? Always a lame. Oh, you thought the money, the power of fame will make you go away. Have you ever played? Have you ever? Okay, nigga, let's play. Have you ever watched your enemy down? Like with a poker face? Have you ever paid 500 thou? Like to an open case? Well, I have, and I failed at both, but I came out straight. I hate when I rap or talk about guns, then somebody die, they turn into nuns. Then I hop online, like pray for my city, he faking for likes and digital hugs. His daddy a killer, he wanna be junior, they must have forgot the shit that they done. Dementia must run in his family, but let it get shaky. Yeah. I park your son. The very first yeah. time I shot me a Drake, the homie had told me to aim it this way. I didn't point down enough. Today I show you I learned from those uh-huh. mistakes. Somebody had told me that you. I'm gonna be standing right above you when I shoot your ass. You remember in the uh-huh. fucking drop and give me 50? Drake said I had to hike down from my mountaintop to drop this song for you. Right. Come on, man. Then somebody died, they turn into nuns. Then I hop online, like pray for my city. He faking for likes and digital hugs. His daddy a killer, he wanna be junior. They must have forgot the shit that they done. Dementia must run in his family, but let it get shaky. I park your son. The very first time I shot me a Drake, the homie had told me to aim it this way. I didn't point down enough. Today I show you I learned from those mistakes. Somebody had told me that you got a ring. Oh God, I'm ready to double the wage. I'd rather do that than let a Canadian nigga make pot turn in his grave. Cut the bitch, you got shit twisted. What is it? The- Bro, that was some heavy shit right there. Yes. Damn. I like that shit, man. He said, I heard you got a ring on. That signifies so many different things, man. And he's willing to battle him, you know? Somebody had told me that you got a ring. Oh, God, I'm ready to double the wage. I'd rather do that See? than let it... And it's not even a joke either that he said on God right after that, right? You, I heard that you got a ring. On God, I'm ready to wage. Like, I'm ready to go at it with you. With the devil. You know right. what I'm saying? It's like, it's fucking dope right there, bro. Take the homie, I told me to aim it this way. I didn't point down enough. Today I show you I learned from those mistakes. Somebody had told me that you got a ring. Oh God, I'm ready to double the wage. I'd rather do that than let a Canadian nigga make pot turn in his grave. Ah. Cut the finish, you got shit twisted. What is it, the brakes? I heard your finish, you don't work with me no more. Okay. It's three ghosts left, and I see two of them kissing and hugging on stage. I love Ooh. them to death, and then eight bars, I'll explain their phrase. It's not nobody can tell me. I'm Bro, he's talking about Drake and, and J. Cole. On kissing stage, on stage. And kissing. Yeah. He said as soon as you go left, you see this you go left, you see them kissing backstage. Yeah. Oh, finish, you got shit twisted. What is it? The brakes? I heard your finish, you don't work with me no more. Okay. It's three ghosts left, and I see two of them kissing and hugging on stage. I love them to death. And then eight bars I'll expect. So three goes left. Three, he says, as three goes left, I see two of them hugging and kissing on stage. Off stage. Or, on, or off stage. Yeah, because when you go left, you go off. Um, for some reason, the, like, on God part is making me think about, like, he just said I was standing above you, right? And he shot you in the chest. But then there's this little part I can't remember, or I just don't want to mis- misspeak. Um, and he says, on oh, God, like, it's about the O's. So I instantly thought of an angel, like, because he killed him, right? So now he's having Pop, Pop turn in his grave because he went to heaven. <laughs> like, he's a, does that make sense? I guess so. Like, on God with the O's, it, like, made, instantly makes you think of, or made me think of that. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I think it's a little double. Maybe. Yeah. And I see two of them kissing and hugging on stage. I love them to death. And then eight bars, I'll explain their phrase. It's not nobody can tell me. I don't want to talk on no celly. You know I got language barriers. It's no accent you can sell me. You're cold and I be no. I'm a selfish nigga. The crown is heavy. I pray they my real friends. If not, I'm YNW Melly. I don't like you popping shit that's for real. For him, my heritage. Oh my god, bro. So the, he just said, he said, in eight bars, I'll, I'll break this down for you. Right after saying, I love these 
I love them to death. Mm-hmm. I'm talking about Cole and Drake. Right. And then he says all that shit. I feel like he was only at six bars, but still, maybe he has two more bars to go. But all that shit he just said about them, or then, or about Drake in particular and himself, and to end it with, if they're not really my friends, I'm white. I'm Melly. I forget the initials for the guy, but that's the rapper that he's like facing first degree murder. He's faith, facing the death sentence. So he's yeah, I love him to death because if they're not my friends, it'll be. Right. Murder. <laughs> That's tight, man. Cut the finish, you got shit twisted. What is it, the brakes? I heard your finish, you don't work with me no more. Okay, there's three ghosts left, and I see two of them kissing and hugging on stage. I love them to death, and then eight bars, I'll explain their phrase. It's not nobody can tell me. I don't want to talk on no celly. You know I got language barriers. It's no accent you can sell me. You're cold yeah. and Ivory, you no, know, I'm a selfish nigga. The crown is heavy. Yeah. I pray they my real friends. If not, I'm YNW Melly. Yeah. I don't like you popping shit at Pharrell for him. I inherit the beef. Yeah, fuck all that pushing P. Let me see you push a T. You better off yeah. spinning again on him. You think about pushing me. Ooh. He's Terrence Thor and I'm Terrence Crawford. Yeah, I'm whooping feet. We ain't gotta get personal, this a friendly fair, you should keep it that way I know some shit about niggas that make gonna wanna look like a saint This ain't been about critics, not about gimmicks, not about who the greatest is Always been about love and hate, now let me say I'm the biggest hater I hate the way that you walk, the way that you talk, I hate the way that you dress I hate the way that you sneak this. if I catch flight it's gonna be direct We hate the bitches you fuck, cause they confuse themselves with real women Then notice I said we, it's not just me, I'm what the culture feeling How many more fairy tale stories about your life till we have Enough. It's not just me that feels these ways about you. I'm the way, I'm the one the culture feeling. The, the real hip hop heads are more Kendrick Lamar fans than they are Drake friends. I'll put that on anything for sure, man. About love and hate, now let me say I'm the biggest hater I hate the way that you walk, the way that you talk I hate the way that you dress, I hate the way that you sneak this If I catch flight, it's gonna be direct We hate yeah. the bitches you fuck, cause they confuse themselves with real women Then notice I said we, it's not just me, I'm what the culture feeling How many more fairy tale stories about your life till we had enough? How many more black features till you finally feel that you're black enough? Yeah. I like Drake with the melodies, I don't like Drake when he act tough You gon' make a nigga bring back Puff, let me see if Chubbs really crash something yeah, my first one, like my last one It's a classic, you don't have one Let your core audience stomach that Didn't tell them where you get your abs from V12, it's a fast one <laughs> Last one Headshot for the year You better walk around like Daft Punk Remember? Can you just say headshot of the year? I want to go back a little bit He just beat switched again too Right, right when you paused it, good yeah. pause Oh man, that was sick. Bro. We, it's not just me, I'm what the culture feeling. How many more fairy tale stories about your life till we had enough? How many more black features till you finally feel that you're black enough? I like Drake with the melodies, I don't like Drake when he act yeah. tough. You gon' make a nigga bring back Puff, let me see if Chubbs really crash something. Yeah, my first one, like my last one. It's a classic, you don't have one. Let your core audience stomach that, didn't tell them where you get your abs from. V12. That have your core audience stomach that where you get your abs from like For real. your ads in the back and uh the man down. also when he's saying that bar it's another skillful technique he uses uh, every three words it sounds like a motorcycle like a vroom that's tight man Enough. I like Drake with the melodies. I don't like Drake when he act tough. You gon' make a nigga bring back Puff. Let me see if Chubbs really crash something. Yeah, my first one, like my last one. It's a classic. You don't have one. Let your core audience stomach that. Didn't tell them where you get your abs from. V12, it's a fast one. Bow, bow, bow. Last one. Headshot for the year. You better walk around like Daft Punk. Remember? A hey, top dog. Who the fuck they think they playing with? Extortion my middle name as soon as you jump off of that plane, bitch. I'm allergic to the lame shit. Only you like being famous Yaddy can't give you no swag neither I don't give a fuck about who you hang with I hate the way that you walk The way that you talk I hate the way that you dress Surprise, she wanted that feature request You know that we got some shit to address I even hate when you say the word nigga But that's just me, I guess Some shit just cringeworthy you Ain't even gotta be deep, I guess Still love when you see success Everything with me is blessed Keep making me dance Waving my hand and it 
won't be no threat I'm knowing they call you the boy, but where's the man? Cause I ain't seen him yet no. Matter of fact, I ain't even bleed him yet Can I bleed him? Bet. When I see you stand by sexy red I believe you see two bad bitches I believe you don't like women It's real competition, you might pop ass with them Let's speak on percentage Show me your splits, I'll make sure how I double back with you You assigned to a nigga that signed to a nigga that said he was signed to that nigga Try cease and assist on a like that record? Bruh you're signed to the sign to the sign to the sign I, one. Yeah. So <laughs> like, if you want to talk about my splits, let's see what the fuck you got going on. Come on, man. The man. I actually like that part in Dropping Gaming 50, though, when he was like, let's talk about splits. Yeah, and, he even paused it for yeah, it. Yeah, he went on a little bit for That was pretty tight. Broke it down for me a little bit. <laughs> Making me dance, waving my hand, and it won't be no threat. I'm knowing they call you the boy, but where's the man? Cause I ain't seen him yet. Matter of fact, I ain't even bleed him yet. Can I bleed him? Bet. When I see you stand by sexy red, I believe you see two bad bitches. I believe you don't like women. It's real competition. You might pop ass with them. Let's speak on percentage. Show me your splits. I'll make sure I double back with you. You assigned to a nigga that signed to a nigga that said he was signed to that nigga. Try cease and assist on a like that. Did he say you might bypass them? I think it's I all I heard was all double back with you. Like so, if you show me your splits, I'll I'll send you mine too. He is blessed. Keep making me dance, waving my hand, and it won't be no threat. I'm knowing they call you the boy, but where's the man? Cause I ain't seen him yet. Matter of fact, I ain't even bleed him yet. Can I bleed him? Bet. When I see you stand by sexy red, I believe you see two bad bitches. I believe you don't like women. It's real competition. You might pop ass with them. Let's speak on percentage. Show me your splits. I'll make sure I double back with you. You assigned to a nigga that signed to a nigga that said he was signed to that nigga. Try cease and assist on a like that record. Oh, what? You ain't like that record? Back to back. I like that record. I'm gonna get back to that for the record. Why would I call around trying to get dirt on niggas? Y'all think of my life as rap? That's whole shit. I got a son to raise, but I can see you don't know nothing about that. Waking them up, no nothing about that. Then tell them to pray, no nothing about that. Then giving them tools to walk through life like day by day, no nothing about that. Oh. Teaching them morals and take. See what I'm saying? He playing with the fucking beat too. On top of these dope ass bars and the super mature response, man. He's doing. He's done like four or five different technical ability techniques on the beat, as well as just general cadence switches, three beat switches so far. He's killing this shit, man. You stand by sexy red, I believe you see two bad bitches. I believe you don't like women, it's real competition. You might pop ass with them. Let's speak on percentage. Show me your splits, I'll make sure I double back with you. You assigned to a nigga that signed to a nigga that said he was signed to that nigga. Try cease and assist on a like that repetition. You might pop ass with them. Let's speak on percentage. Show me your splits, I'll make sure I double back with you. You assigned to a nigga that signed to a nigga that said he was signed to that nigga. Try cease and assist on a like that record. Oh, what you ain't like that record? Back to back, I like that record. I'm gonna get back to that for the record yeah. why would i call around trying to get dirt on niggas y'all think of my life is rap that's whole shit i got a son to raise but i can see you don't know nothing about that oh. waking them up no nothing about that then tell them to pray no nothing about that then giving them tools to walk through life like day by day no nothing about that teaching them morals integrity discipline listen man you don't know nothing about that speaking the truth and consider what god's cause bro that's a hard ass diss man that shit would hit hard jerk got a kid out there right yeah but see you're like a dad so if anybody ever said that to you, it would like hit super hard, right? Yeah. Because then you'd be like, I guess, that's true. Bills. We don't know. We don't know how Drake is. If, if he's yeah, but still, I don't feel like Kendrick Lamar has been spitting bullshit. He, well, he literally no, no. started off by saying, "Stop telling your lies," and went into the truth. I definitely think he's agreeing, but like, when I listen to him, I'm like, "Ooh, that's a badass bar." Like, I didn't have a dad, right? But from your perspective, listening to it, like. Your dad was a really good dad to you, and then now you're a really good dad, right? So the bars yeah. are going to hit different for you because sure. you're like, wow, how could anybody ever say that about, you know? Yeah. So, well, yeah. <laughs> so it's going to be a little bit different for you. I know it's, it's going to hit a harder. I don't give a fuck. I don't hit anybody, man. It's going gonna, it's gonna to hit somebody. It's not going to hit Drake as hard as it's going to hit somebody that's a good dad. Does that make sense? I guess so. Because like, when you're a piece of shit dad, most of the time you know why you're a piece of shit dad, you know, like, sure, it hurts their know. feelings, but to even know that that little, that kid of his is going without a dad hurts you more, you know All what right. I mean? All right, yeah, that makes sense. Back to that for the record. Why would I call around trying to get dirt on niggas? Y'all think of my life as rap? That's whole shit. I got a son to raise, but I can see you don't know nothing about that. Waking them up, no nothing about that. Then tell them to pray, no nothing about that. Then giving them tools to walk through life like day by day, no nothing about that. Teaching them morals, integrity, discipline. Listen, man, you don't know nothing about that. Speaking the truth and consider what God's considering. You don't know nothing about that. Ain't 20 v one, it's one v twenty. If I gotta smack niggas, that right with you. Yeah, bring them out too. I clean them out too. Tell Bean that he better stay right with you. Am I battling ghosts or AI? 
Nigga feeling like Joe Hill Austin. Funny he was in a film called AI. I thought about that too, man. I thought about the AI shit. Am I battling ghosts or AI? I thought about that, man. How Drake gets some of his good ass shit, you know? But we all know Drake can do his thing. I ain't know nothing about that Teaching no morals, integrity, discipline Listen man, you don't know nothing about that Speaking the truth and consider what God's considering You don't know nothing about that Ain't 20 v 1, it's 1 v 20 If I gotta smack niggas that right with you Yeah, bring them out too, I clean them out too Tell Bean that he better stay right with you Am I battling ghosts or AI? Nigga feeling like Joe Hill Austin Tell Bean he better stay right with you But right with you when we fight Come on man 20 v 1, it's 1 v 20 If I gotta smack niggas that right with you Yeah, bring them out too, I clean them out too Tell Bean that he better stay right with you Am I battling ghosts or AI? Nigga feeling like Joe Hill Austin Funny he was in a film called AI And my sixth sense telling me to off him I'm a brick nigga, all in the coffin Yeah, OV ho niggas is dick riders Tell him run to America to imitate heritage Bro, this, this last beat is fucking hard This might not even be the last beat, but this one's hard It's a long song Yeah, it is, I didn't even notice that we're almost done I clean him out too. Tell Bean that he better stay right with you. Am I battling ghosts or AI? Nigga feeling like Joe Hill Austin. Funny he was in a film called AI. And my sixth sense telling me to off him. I'm a brick nigga, all in the coffin. Yeah, OV ho niggas is dick riders. Tell them run to America to imitate heritage. They can't imitate this violence. What I learned is niggas don't like the West Coast. And I'm fine with it. I'll push the line with it. Pick a nigga off one at a time with it. We can be on a three hour time difference. Don't speak on the family, Crody. It can get deep in the family, Crody. Talk about me and my family, Crody. Someone go bleed in your family, Crody. I'll be a new hawk king eating fried rice with a dip sauce and a blammy, Crody. Tell me your cheese and farm. We can do this right now on the camera, Crody. Hey, fuck y'all niggas. I don't trust y'all niggas. I wait. Oh, I feel like that little food's steaming over my head. Mine too, a little bit. Imitate heritage, they can't imitate this violence. What I learned is niggas don't like the West Coast, and I'm fine with it. I'll push the line with it. Pick a nigga off one at a time with it. We can be on a three hour time difference. Don't speak on the family, Crody. It can get deep in the family, Crody. Talk about me and my family, Crody. Someone go bleed in your family, Crody. I be a new hawk king eating fried rice with a dip sauce and a blammy, Crody. Tell me you're cheesing fine. He changes his cadence right there for a second. He says, I'll be at I'll be at so and so place with a cheese and fried rice, bro. Like Cody. He's calling him Cody or Crody, I forget. Um he said something about not making your family or something about making his family bleed. Yeah, he said, Don't talk about my family or someone in your family gonna bleed. Yeah, I like how he worded that. Yeah. Uh, that was clever. With the know? cadence too. Exactly, that was clever. Yeah, he's 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 killing it, man. Crody, it can get deep in the family, Crody. Talk about me and my family, Crody. Someone go bleed in your family, Crody. I be a new hawk king. And Crody, what is that? Is that slang for something, or is that like his other name? You know, like his the demon name, his demon that he's got, or whatever. You know, like come on, subliminals all day on shit like that. Bam, bam, we're back. All right, let's go back a little bit more. 20 v 1, it's 1 v 20 if I gotta smack niggas that right with you Yeah, yeah bring them out too, I clean them out too Tell Bean that he better stay right with you Am I battling ghosts or AI? Nigga feeling like Joe Hill Austin Funny he was in a film called AI And my sixth sense telling me to off him I'm a brick niggas all in the coffin Yeah, OV ho niggas is dick riders Tell him when And my sixth sense is telling me to off him So the actor he named could potentially be an actor that was in Sixth Sense the movie as well But my sixth sense, right? We all have like a sixth sense, right? Like the spider the, vision or whatever, yeah. right? But also like 666. Like you're a fucking demon snake kind of person and my sixth sense is going off. So that's hard, bro. Sits telling me to off him. I'm a brick niggas all in the coffin. Yeah, OV ho niggas is dick riders. Tell them run to America to imitate heritage. They can't imitate this violence. What I learned is niggas don't like the West Coast and I'm fine with it. I'll push the line with it. Pick a nigga off one at a time with it. We can be on a three hour time difference. Don't speak on the family, Crody. It can get deep in the family, Crody. Talk about me and my family, Crody. Someone go bleed in your family, Crody. I be a new hawk king eating fried rice with a dip sauce and a blammy, Crody. Tell me your cheese and farm. We can do this. Fried rice with dip sauce and a blammy. Yeah, like, I'll be here at this restaurant with cheese, fried rice, dip sauce, and a blammy. Okay. So, get new uh, come, come get me, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Family, Crody. Talk about me and my family, Crody. Someone go bleed in your family, Crody. I be a new hawk king eating fried rice with a dip sauce and a blammy, Crody. Tell me your cheese and farm. We can do this right now on the camera, Crody. Hey, fuck y'all niggas. Uh, I don't trust y'all. He said, tell me your cheese and fam. I thought it was a food scheme, but he literally is just saying, I'm at this spot with my gap, bro. Come get some. Like, I know you're cheesing. Like, I know you're like, oh, shit, Kendrick dropped something. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro.
Speak on the family, Crody. You can get deep in the family, Crody. Talk about me and my family, Crody. Someone go bleed in your family, Crody. I be a new hawk king eating fried rice with a dip sauce and a blammy, Crody. Tell me your cheese and farm. We can do this right now on the camera, Crody. Hey, fuck y'all niggas, I don't trust y'all niggas. I weigh one finger and thump y'all niggas like, mm, feel go punk y'all niggas, they punk y'all niggas. Nobody never took my food. Whoever that's fucking weird, them fuck you niggas and fuck the industry too. If you take it there, I'm taking it yeah. for us. That's something you don't wanna do. Ooh. We don't wanna hear you say nigga no more. We don't wanna hear you say nigga no more. Stop. Oh my god, bro. Six minutes. He killed him. Yeah. I like didn't realize how long it was, but um it's longer because we paused it so many times. Um But he has so much so much in the six minutes and twenty three seconds. Like all the technical like technical stuff you were talking about, all the different cadences, the switches, the beat switches, the fucking doubles after triples, you know, like and then just being an adult about it and saying like this is what it is, yeah. you know, like not I don't know. I really enjoyed it. I thought it was super good. Yeah, that was hard, man. That was the best of all the dishes we've heard so far in this yeah. little beef going on, honestly, man. Fucking and like killed it. That part where he's all like talking about like don't talk about my family and then in the background or no, he's all like Talking about being the dad and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. I like how there's that second voice underneath that's like answering him and like in the background. Yeah, like, like no, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Kendrick's good at that shit, man. He's super technical. That's what I was saying. He's so good. Um. Anyways, yeah, fucking dope. Kendrick Lamar killed it, man. That was fucking sick. That's hip hop right there. That's like top tier echelon hip hop right there. Fucking amazing. So, hope you guys enjoyed that. Anything else? No, I said quite a bit. I want to see like. A reaction to this from like other upper echelon artists, you know, like M and fucking Crooked Eye and shit like that, you know what I'm saying? Like Royce, fucking people like that, people yeah. over in that corner. Yeah, that'd be cool. Shit, man. That'd be or, super like cool. to be able to watch Drake's reaction or J. Cole's reaction, come on, that'd be sick, but whatever. Euphoria, man. Kendrick Lamar, thank you. Keeping hip hop burning, keeping that shit going, man. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Don't forget to like and subscribe and head over to Kendrick's channel. Show him some love for this, as well as other, his other platforms he probably released this on. And uh, we'll catch you guys in the next one. Real reactions, we out of here.